All right, folks, this one is 737 East 34th Street. It's at the end of a very long cul-de-sac or dead end street, whatever you want to call it. So the uh, street itself is just just totally peaceful, very quiet. Um, I did meet the neighbor. She's back on right now. She's very cool. So th those are, I mean, right off the bat, two huge pluses uh, for this house, the neighbors and the neighborhood. Walking in, I got a huge charge out of this. Those lines are actually a red marker and black ballpoint pen to make it look like tile. <laughs> so here's the, uh, I guess you'd call it the living room. And then the uh, family room, I guess you'd call it that right there. I mean, obviously that's where they had their TV. The flooring in here is a little, uh, you know, it's an old kind of, Maybe it's original wood floor, I don't know, but this was built in 92. It, it just feels a lot older than that. The uh, kitchen's missing all the appliances. A few other things that are that probably were here that are gone now. Um, there's obviously was a deck back there. You can see where the posts were. Uh, as far as the repair escrow, it is FHA financeable, but it's got a uh, repair escrow of 1540 bucks. Nice big lot back there. And the repair escrow concerns uh, securing exposed wiring, repairing the furnace, 550, re replacing the floor covering, which is probably just on the floor that I'm walking on right now, and then just replacing the vent covers. They took pretty much everything that could be easily taken, so there's no mirrors in the bathrooms. This is the laundry room, by the way. It's kind of a uh, just a half bath here on the, I guess it would be the lower level. Let's head up the basement real quick. Kind of a storage room with some philosophical stuff on the walls there. I read through most of it and a lot of it didn't make any sense. Um, they've got, as you can see, hot and cold probably right here, but I don't know what this would be for. Um, I haven't quite figured that out. So, I mean, maybe they were gonna do a, another bathroom down here. I don't know, but you can see where they have, um, I guess a commode. I mean, just based on the, the, the footprint of what was painted around, but it doesn't quite make any sense. So, I don't know. I don't know. The plumbing looks pretty new, though. Two car garage. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. All functional. Pretty decent light in the dining area there. And this is three bedrooms. This is a three bed, I call it a two and a half bath. It's more like a a full bath, a three quarter bath in the master, and then a half bath downstairs. This is a pretty sharp room. I like it. The one full bath right here, again, missing the uh, mirror, not a big deal. And then the nice and bright master, which given the you know, somewhat eccentric paint, it actually looks fairly decent for most of the stuff that I run into. So here you go. Hello. Walk-in closet and the three-quarter bath for the rest of it anyway. So there you have it. This one's coming at 165 at 737 East 34th Street in Loveland. $100 down here in Loveland.